left off, the Modoc leaders had signed a treaty in 1864 that would move them to the Klamath Indian Reservation. It was cramped, it was cold. The Modoc were ill treated and abused by the Klamath Indians, who were actually their rivals and enemies. Um, Captain Jack had gone to the agent um, of Indian Affairs three times, and uh, they kept ignoring him and denying him. Uh, their time of day, and Captain Jack said, quote, I am not a dog. I am a man if I am an Indian. I and my men shall not be slaves for a race that is not only, that is not any better than my people. I shall not live here. If the government refuses to protect my people, who shall I look to for protection, end quote. In April, the government had stopped their rations completely, and so he took his people and went back to the Lost River, which is their homeland. Here, it was disrupted very much by the whites. Uh, the Modocs had to work um, as ranch hands to earn their rent and their keep there, and um, uh, eventually it became a very hostile situation. The Modoc were bitter because that was their homeland. Um, and they would demand food from the whites. They would just walk into their houses and ask for supper um, without even knocking. Uh, so the settlers wanted them out, of course. And so in the fall of 1872, Indian agent Thomas O'Neill um, wrote to the government asking them uh, for help. And uh, the government wrote back and said, um, move the Modoc back to the reservation, peaceably if you can, forcibly if you must. So basically, whatever force necessary um, and this was obviously not the right way to do it. And so, um, they called in, they sent 35 cavalrymen from the south, and them, joined with local settlers, came upon Captain Jack's camp of Modocs. And Captain Jack was asleep at this time, and the white people were trying to arrest the Modoc, and uh, Scarface Charlie was another leader of the Modoc. Uh, he held his ground against the lieutenant, <clears throat> and they both fired, they both missed, and both sides began shooting. Uh, so, November 29th, 1872, unexpectedly, the war began. Captain Jack and his people canoed south to an ancient lava flow, which I will show you on the map right here. Okay. There's the Klamath Indian Reservation. You can see this is where they traveled down to the Lost River. Right here, these little X's, is where the battle on the Lost River was and where the Modoc War began. Um, Captain Jack and his crew canoed down to the lava beds here at the bottom of Tool Lake. Meanwhile, the whites attacked other bands of the Modoc that had not gone with Captain Jack down to the lava beds um, and killed three. The, Mod the Modoc retaliated against the uh, settlers and Hooker Jim took his band of Modocs and teamed up with Captain Jack down at the lava beds. Um, 
And here there was a small, determined fighting force, about 55, that's it, 55 Modocs at the lava beds. Um, and it was named Jack's Stronghold. It's about 47,000 acres, 700 caves, natural uh, defensive fighting ground. On my next video, I will tell you how this war went down at the lava beds.